Uh, you already know it's Kev Cash, Harlem shit. I'm in the building with Ace Speed Live and DJ Wall, you heard? Kev Cash, Harlem baby, you know who I be. Got them niggas mad cause she wanna roll with me Play, play the game, no pillow talking under sheets She getting mad cause I'm flirting, well then she could leave I don't really care, cause I'm off the drugs now Cooling with the thugs now, we gon' have some fun now Pop a pill, throw it back, then she bust down Bitches can't front now, I'm the one they want now Hey, tell them boys fall back, weed and the liquor boy I be on all that Don't you try to save me, talking all this love shit Don't you try to play me Cause that shit won't phase me Henny and my system, I might go crazy Sour got me lazy And I love to turn up, I love to get wavy I love to get on I love to get too on I love to get on I love to get too on We got this artist in here from Harlem You know, he came all the way From up to down, make his way to Long Island uh, You know, we got a young MC Up and coming MC My man Kevin Cash is in the building What's good, bro? What's up, what's up? All right, all right. You know, welcome to Loop Radio on yakradio.com. Uh, you know, we always start the, the interview off with, it's like an essay type, where we get the introduction, the body, and the, the outro. You know, so you always get to the, the beginning, like... The conclusion. The, yeah, the conclusion. I keep saying outro, I know. <laughs> <laughs> the end of the conclusion, but we always start off from the beginning, like... What's the story behind the name Kev Cash? Obviously, Kevin is your first name. Yeah. Um, but how did you lift, how did you get the name Cash? What made you choose Cash out of everything oh, else? Oh man, two, huh? two things. Like one, I love the cash. Okay. <laughs> two, um, when I was making a MySpace, I was like, oh, it's my name be. Like, I said, I thought of it. Ever since then, I just made that my name for everything. Okay. Like, everybody started calling me that, so I started putting my name there. Okay. okay. All right, so it's mentioned that you're from Harlem. What part of Harlem you from? 135th from Broadway. 135th from Broadway. West side. West side? Okay. Yeah. West side. That's definitely what's up. All right, so how did Harlem um, basically um, breed you? Harlem? I mean, I grew up on the streets. Like, I ain't have nothing. So I was like, you know what? Everybody was trapping. And I'm like, that's not really my thing. I tried, but it wasn't my thing. Mm-hmm. So I'm like, let me rap. I was nine years old. I started rapping. I started taking it serious like two years ago. And I just started doing my thing after that. All right, that's most definitely. So how did rap um, provide you with a way out of the streets? Because instead of hanging out on the corner, I was now I was traveling. I was in the studios. Mm-hmm. I was staying out the streets, having fun on the street. I'm having fun in the studio. It's even better. Most oh, definitely. And you're from Harlem. Harlem has a great reputation from MCs. Um, growing up, which type of MCs did you gravitate toward? I like Vado, Jim Jones, <laughs> all of the Max B. Yeah, yeah, okay. Free Max B. <laughs> all of them, you see? All right, most definitely. Um, also, um, Harlem is also known for um, money making. That's a fact. <laughs> you know what's so sad? Line GR. Versace, Versace, I'm chilling with hoes and I'm my kitchen sloppy. I don't play no ball, I shoot like D Rose and I'm my kitchen body. It was me and the team, my niggas shoot games, meet up in the lobby. I got the thing on me, so tell me who gonna rob me? It's Kev Cash, I'm YNGI, and G.I. and who gonna stop me? I don't trust these niggas, they probably don't want no haters around me. Nah. I keep some bands, I keep a grip just in case you get real Ooh. I'm fucking these stars, they falling in love, but they know the deal no 45, I let it slide, I'm down the ride, I want you, I, I do the shit, I know a lot I just laugh, I ain't tryna cry, my with the shits, tryna make a flip Little nigga, I'm getting rich, I let it this and that, stay clear This ain't a game, I leave you wet, I never run, I'm running shit This cat cash, I'm running shit, I go crazy, you know I'm running with I see a op, he running quick, I don't play no fucking game I hit a nigga in his fucking brain Brain screen, they go insane A reputation like that, starting a whole bunch of trends and things like that What type of trends do you think that you'll start in the industry? Trends? I mean, I hope to motivate a lot of people like that really feel like they can't do it mm-hmm. I ain't think I could do it I ain't think I could get anything mm-hmm. At first I thought I was just another person watching rappers on TV That want to be like them Mm-hmm. And I started doing it, everybody started coming up to me like, oh, yo, that's Kev Cash. Like, yeah. Like, oh, yo, I heard your song. I started hearing it. I'm like, 
let me keep on doing this. So I started making videos, and I know I can motivate a lot of people like that, because a lot of people came up from Harlem too. Mm -hmm. Don't let me Now, you said you was nine years old. Nine years like old. Like when you started. Um, what was some of the feedback that you got? From that first round that you kicked, you um, remember that first round you kicked when you was nine? Yeah, I, I got my round. Like, <laughs> I was listening to Little Wayne and Fifty Cent and nine years old. Okay. So I was like, yo, they, they spend heat. Like, so I wrote in my little notepad, my little notebook, and I used to spit it to my cousin. He used to be like, yo, man, young we got, we got some heat going on. Like, I used to think he was gassing me, though. Like, you know, so, you know, everybody be gassing the kids. Like, oh, yeah, they be saying some other shit, but. Nah, everybody started telling me that. I'm like, yeah, I know I'm nice. After a while, I'm like, I know I'm nice, man. Nobody gas me. I know I'm nice. Mm -hmm. Got it. All right, so um, Harlem also has um a good reputation for uh, street battlers. Um, have you dabbled in that world? Street battles? Yeah, like you know, with the battle rappers, they have uh you know murder mook. Mm -hmm. Yeah, uh, legendary rappers, Charlie Clips. Mm -hmm. But if somebody else said, yo, let's freestyle or whatever, I never turned it down. So I made it interesting after I started, like, I was better than you. So I was like, let's do it for the money. So mm -hmm. I used to do freestyles back to back for the money. And I used to win them. And I was like, right, but I'm not really a battle rapper. Man. I like being on the mic on the studio. Mm -hmm. So I you have a freestyle? You freestyle free that? I freestyle, but yeah, I'm nice with the freestyle. You know, I don't do it so much. Like, I really just... I be in the studio, I hear a beat, and I just write whatever right there, and it comes out fire. Like. I am a thot. I'm a thot. Give me lit. Yeah. Yeah. Hold up. Yeah. 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 Hold up. That niggas wasn't working. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Tryna be my mom, shorty, you commit these balls. I will let you be my niggas, but you just might fuck them all. I'm about to kill a thing. In the Asian, you gon' tell me, hit my nigga ass. Shitting on these niggas, heard these niggas out the game. I'ma let them meet the sturdy, I'ma show them what they get When they pull up to the ad, don't believe these bitches When they say that they gon' last, I'm just tryna check a bag Pop a tax, make some mass, stuff my whole should be a pump Little nigga, that's a strike, I ain't tryna get emotional I hate y'all boys talking, but y'all really ain't important though My loud and bored though, why them with some boring hoes All they wanna do is blow, all they wanna do is smoke But I won't take them to my shows, I won't take them to my house Cause that's where my mama stay, getting it like every day Get this deal, I gotta wait, get some food up on my plate Talking shit behind my back, but they won't say it to my face Plus my lawyer beat the case, so I'm celebrating New money, new clothes, but all these new faces That rapper fuck is stuck, my niggas they down the bus Let the sour hit your lungs, I can trust these bitches Nah, they just tryna fuck, like call up, I'm about to come Get up, pick up the gun, like baby I gotta run My nigga, this shit for fun, no kisses unless it's tongue I'm freaking on the weekend, they freaking that man speaking They freaking, I must be sneaking, it's funny stuff to the ceiling Like all I would've feeling, fuck, uh, uh Kev, you gotta chill shit. 10 minutes, 15 minutes. Wow. Today I just made a song with that clip with 10 vocals. <laughs> so let's get into your thought process when you're going into creating a song. Um, what are you thinking first? You, like you said, you hear the beat and then you go into the studio and start uh, creating your rounds. Yeah. Um, what do you put more focus into, like the hook? Or are you trying to put more substance into like the bars? First, I put more substance into the hook because when I hear the hook, then I know how I'm gonna jump in the verse. Mm -hmm. The hook is very important in the song. That's what makes the song a hook. Otherwise, it's just another freestyle. So, who are some of the people that you work with? You know, that's some people that we would know. Um, man, y'all, y'all know Little Dirk in them, right? Yeah. Y'all ever heard the name Take Six Hundred? They be saying his name in their song. Like, yeah. Yeah, he from the area. Yeah, I did a song with him. Mm -hmm. What well, is song with? Shout out to Christian Dior. Like, I ho I'm hoping to do a song with a couple of rappers. Okay. I was just talking to uh, so Corey from Ness and a Billy on from GS9. Okay. All right. Yeah, 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 yeah. Now, you, you look like one of the cats that we had up here. <laughs> we had OP up here this summer, uh, this past summer. And y'all kind of resemble. I'm like, you know, I'm looking at one of your pics in your Instagram. The picture, but I think he got the same shirt. Yeah, I was about to say that. Like, the same shirt too. Is that OP right there? Like, <laughs> am I on the right page right now? Uh, OP doing his thing. <laughs> doing his thing. Nah, so definitely. And y'all both, y'all both y'all rep that the 1090. 1090, or... You know. So, well, what's the story behind that? What's up with 1090? 
and ninety. I mean, it's like it's not a gang, like it's just like a lifestyle. Mm -hmm. Ten ninety. <laughs> All right, so you said it's a lifestyle. So let the people know the typical lifestyle. All right, waking up in the morning to to go in the bed. What's your typical day like? You said it's a lifestyle. So let the people know what your lifestyle is like. It's more of a hood lifestyle. This is a nest. Like this, 1090 means 10 percent loyal, 90 percent grimy. Oh, okay. That's what it means. That was the, that's how it started. But um, you know, it just means looking out for yourself. Mm. Nobody else gonna look out for you but yourself. You gonna take care of yourself, so you gonna do you. Don't worry about nobody else. Just stay be grimy. <laughs> <laughs> that's, right. that's the same concept. As I, was, I was just about to say that. So if I ask you this, man, all right, let's say you in the car with your with your with your homeboy. Yeah. I uh, this is what was his name? Scum Lord, right? Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, he gave us this kind of scenario. So let's say you in the you in the whip with your hands. <laughs> y'all about to y'all about to like y'all about to do something. Like let's say you're about to go play ball or something, but you know y'all driving there. He's driving there, whatever, right? And um you look down and you see like twenty dollars like kinda like poking out from between the seat <laughs> next to your foot, right? Yeah. Like what what would you do? Because you said turn on your lifestyle. <laughs> So it's certain people that take that life to the extreme. So which so you'll give you'll give your man the twenty like yo, I think you dropped this. Personally, one. me, me, my man's, yeah, he gave me twenty. Alright, now, 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 now if it's if it's my man's man's and I don't know him, then you're right. I'm taking the twenty. <laughs> 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 Because we had somebody up here, and even if it's his man's, like even if it's his man's, like he grew up with him, right? like right next door type of shit, and he sees a twenty, he says he's gonna reach down and put it in a sock. Some people like that. Yeah. <laughs> so I guess it took life out to the extreme. Man. That's what you're yeah, I know. I make sure the people that's around me will give me back my twenty, just like I was giving back their twenty. Right, right, right. So everybody eats on your team. Is what you're my definition of ten ninety is. I'll be 1090 to anybody, but not to family and friends. Like, I'll be loyal to them. Everybody else gets a 1090 treatment. That's what I'm doing. I don't know about that one. <laughs> yeah, well, I guess. Uh, so, uh, this, the scum lord is a little different. Everybody's yeah, gonna be different over there. Everybody's gonna be scum. That's just his yeah. thing. He kept it 100. He kept it 100. He definitely did. Yeah. Yeah. So now we know this. It's levels. It's, it's scum life, it's and then there's levels. 10 items. <laughs> <laughs> levels, levels. You know there's levels now. Uh, yeah, exactly. Uh, now, I, I think I saw on, um, on Instagram. Are, are you going to be doing something with um, the young kid? Uh, Trader Kid? Trader Kid? Yeah. Yeah, we've been chopping it up lately. Mm -hmm. uh, so he, he endorsed me on Instagram. I, I see that. Yeah. He got a um, mixtape coming out. Shout out to him. Mm -hmm. Nice thing. You might look out for that when you see Kid Cash on there. So what's the affiliation? How'd you guys link up? I mean, we just it's some Instagram thing. Like, I don't personally know that like, we never chill. Mm -hmm. But I know it's from Instagram. Like, you just chopping it up. He, he followed me. Yeah. Then I started looking at his stuff. Like, why? Because I didn't even know who that was at first. Yeah. He followed me. And he just chopping it up in the DM. Like, he said, got a mixtape coming up. Okay. Yeah, that's what's up, because he follows me too, right? So I'm following him. He got a nice little following. Yeah, he got his thing going. Too. Yeah, he, he got, got some nice OP too, right? Huh? Yeah, he got some OP, yeah. Yeah. So, nah, that, that's what's up. Um, are we going to hear a track? We, we doing OP? Yeah, hopefully. <laughs> I was talking to him too, that big. 
Right now, I'm trying to work on something with Cody from that in Miami right now. So that's a from Brooklyn, right? Yeah, he's from Brooklyn. Yeah, yeah he's he kind of nice. Yeah. He's from that's good, man. Oh, that's good. So you're looking to work with a lot of but indie artists, too, guys that's going to come up. Mm-hmm. So has anyone from Harlem that's established, like Cam or anyone from Dipset or Violet, have they reached out to you to do a track with you or vice versa? No, but today, like I said, I did a track with Tim Vocals. Mm-hmm. Tim Vocals associated with Jada Kiss and Nino Man. Okay, and they, he's they tough. They getting in, getting it in right now. Yeah. So whatever, he was on the phone with Jada and everything. And once this song is out, he's gonna promote it. Mm-hmm. He's gonna let them hear it. We gonna try to get a video done, get it on World Star. Oh, okay. Mm-hmm. Once that's done, you know it's the next step. You know they gonna come reaching for me after that. Right. So you track up the top. Yeah, that's a fact. Like, what's up? That's what's up. Just the end of the video, yakreader.com. Chopping it up with Kev Cash from Harlem Uptown. He's in the building. Uh, so what can we expect in the future? You know, any mixtape EPs? Mixtapes. Right now, I'm just trying to kill every beat right now. Like, mm-hmm. Every beat. Then I'm going uh, to start working on mixtapes soon. Mm-hmm. I'll tell you next month. I got enough songs. Yeah, okay. I got enough songs. <laughs> so what, what's some of the tracks that, that you done touched already? In, in the feedback that you got from the people? Every track I do, they give me some good feedback. Like, I never heard nothing bad. Mm-hmm. Maybe when I first started, they're like, oh yeah, you gotta work on this. Now everybody just be like, yo, Kev, you got way better. Mm-hmm. You got way better. But I never used to hear that from nobody. So now I'm hearing all that. It's like, alright, good looking. You, you start to feel like, alright, it's just basically giving me confidence. It's giving me confidence. But I already had confidence because I ain't had nobody supporting at first. Mm-hmm. Now I got everybody supporting. So I was like, alright, but nobody wanna support me. Alright, y'all gonna support me one day. Today is that day. <laughs> so, uh, so are you known in Harlem? Like, uh, yeah, my whole block show me love. You know, I got there's people in Dyke and listen to me. There's a lot of people I don't even know. They be commenting on them and stuff. Mm-hmm. I don't know them. They be watching my videos on YouTube. And they be rocking me, but I feel like I'm still at not at that level that I want to be. Like, there's still more to go. Yeah, way more to go. But I'm taking another step today. So. That's the who's up, man. You looking forward to that? We looking forward to that release. You know what I mean? <laughs> the back. So we're gonna get into a section, the name of association section that we have with all our artists that we do. And basically what happens is we mention a name and you tell us the first thing that comes to to your head when we say that name. This is gonna be a Harlem edition. You feel me? What you mean? I I I'll name someone. Let's say I'll name someone from Harlem like um who sang that um chicken noodle soup joint? Oh. DJ Webstar. Oh, I saw Webstar. No, I say something like that. You just say the first thing that comes to your to your mind. You know what I mean? It don't matter how crazy it is. You just keep it on, keep it a stack. And if you think he's a clown, say clown. I keep it a stack. Oh, oh, we kept it a stack when he came. <laughs> and he ain't held no punches. Um, all right, so we're gonna start off, you know, with a start of life. A hometown hero, Kim. Cam? Yeah. That's that nigga. Okay. That's that nigga. Cam. Fisher. Um, Jim Jones. Jim Jones, Capo, too. He be doing his thing. I think of him, I think of all of them, too. All right, so, so hold on. I'm going to ask you a question. This, we still got the name association. When that beef went down with Cam and, and Jim, whose side were you on? I'm going to lie, I always rock with Cam. Okay. Always rock with Cam. All right. G Dub. Who? G Dub. G Dub. Nice. Alright. Um. What's the model, mom? Mace. Mace. Oh, yeah, he was on some the other day. I mean, I don't really listen to him anymore, though. Like. <laughs> yeah, shout out to Mace, though. Stuff, yeah, they, they beat something. Um, Vado, your boy, you say he, nah, he down? Vado, number one, like that's my name. I already fuck with his songs. Yeah. Every day. Mm-hmm. Um, Nino Man. That nigga be killing shit right now. Like, <clears throat> he doing his thing too, like. Right now his name is Buzzing. Who be in Harlem? He's putting yeah. for that. Yeah, he put it down. Cash flow. Cash flow killing shit too. ASAP. ASAP. I think he's falling off right now. Mm-hmm. 
Like he, he too busy worrying about other stuff right now. Like his image. Exactly. All right, um, he's at first. He's at first. And then he pop into him. And it's just slow ASAP cool right now. It's ASAP cool. Um, Big L. Big L's a legend. This way he got the roots down, man. Yeah. You know, you know all the um old school artists and definitely give respect to them, give respect to the new school artists, and that's what we like as an MC. So, all right, being that's from Harlem, um, what was your what 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 move was better? <laughs> Juice uh, above the rim, paid in full for New Jack City. Give me your order. Order in order? Yeah. Uh, we got paid in full first Oh, all right, good choice. And we got New Jack City. Good choice. And we got Juice. And we got Butter Okay. Right. We can't really go wrong. Right. With, can't go wrong, right. With any of those, you know what I mean? All of them took, took place out there. Right. You know? Um, we about to get to the best part that we love, man. We got some artists that definitely came through and killed it. You're going to be the first person from Harlem mm -hmm. to step on the mic. Yeah, sure. Why, in the speech? Oh, yeah, I forgot I had to do that. Mm -hmm. huh. Huh. <laughs> DJ Var. You want a little, radio, it. little <laughs> radio man with your boy DJ Var, Be Live, Ace Boogie, what's up? We got the boy Kev Cash in the building. Listen, man, I'm going to give you some rules real quick. I do this all my artists. I'm looking for the best artists to rip these freestyles. Now the producers, for some reason, <laughs> why y'all keep putting that on me? <laughs> he was saying, uh, he, he wants to know what I'm gonna do with all these artists. And I got a plan, don't worry about it. <laughs> I'm gonna give you the same instrumentals I give them. Ace was vouching for you right here. You know what I mean? Every time we bring artists in, we have a record. Right now I'm seven and one. I'm batting over 500 right now. <laughs> um, <laughs> I'm not gonna talk about that loss, but um, yeah, I'm expecting you to rip it. Gotcha. I'm gonna store you some instrumentals. You ready? Yeah, I'm always ready. That's all I did. Right. This is the Inlook Radio, jackwithers.com. Cash Cash, but the blessings for the free staff. Sip like in my backpack, walking up to niggas like you hustle, I need half that. And if you wasn't with it, you would fit it like a snapback. Paint that nigga picture, you would vivid like a snapchat. Never with the chicken, or the chatting, I just grabbed that. Different ways of living, and my vision gotta grab that. I seen them be that nigga that these bitches throw their ass at. Coming to my crib, trying to find out where the stash at. Never trust a bitch with a smile and a fat ass. They looking for the cheese, so I'm setting up these mouse traps. Yeah, so I'm setting up these mouse traps. Yeah, yeah, setting up these mouse traps. Huh? He's setting up the mouse traps, man. <laughs> Get my man a little beat, man. Woo! Yeah, guys, you the building. Uh, Harlem World, Uptown. Yeah, you know, it's all of them. from Broadway. Yes, sir. DJ Vaughn. Y'all set for this? Mm. Uptown. It ain't Harlem, but, you know, <laughs> Bronx. You put a boogie down? Yeah. Yeah. Before you end up missing different parts of your whole body, different places in the kitchen, this might be a tough decision. But you end up with decisions. You try to be a tough guy, then you really don't like living. Stop murder shit and I body beats my bitch. Bad she got the heat if you need the light to cop me. I ain't rich yet, but I'm about to be riding through the city with no license and these drugs. So if I hear them sirens, I'll be out before they come. Cause the cops won't catch me now. And they ain't gonna catch me then if you ain't with me when I'm losing them come digger out when I win. I ain't no trick, I always said it, never needed no new friends. I'll be out here on my toe, and you know I get it in. Got that semi automatic. If you want it, you can have it. Niggas never play. Cause they know I love the static, I'm something just like a savage. Fall as you fall from average, tell niggas stay in their bracket before they up this package. Go, yeah. Oh, no, man. Yeah. <laughs> this in the building. This boy right here flowing, man. He flowing, he, he, he flowing, right? He, he yeah. going in, right? He going in. Yes, sir. All of them is in the building, man. 718. Y'all already know what it is. You got that number yeah. You know what's that nails? Got some shit. Feeling this? Shout out to 125th, man. 
I just go to a bar over there, man. Cause you know I don't work out there no more, so I can't even rock with them no more. Something when you sleep. Before you by my side, put a nigga on the team. Grew up on a block, young niggas in the streets. You could do you, I'ma do me. You the main event, so the shows ain't free. Keep it tucked away so these ops don't see. I'ma haul a nigga getting money off beats. None of these hoes getting money off me. She a bad bitch, got her shits on feet. I'm a real nigga, fake nigga, not me. Baby on the work, so he coming right now. Pack got the drop, so it's about to go down. Do a couple hits, then we spring out of town. That she girl, but she mm, right now. Pull up for us, all y'all niggas know us. If you really want beef, nigga, what's the hold up? He's in the cut, and you know he about to roll up. Always on pimp, bet your whole squad fold up. Say they couldn't hear me, now they hit the bass up. Uh, put the bass up. Yes, Harlem. Harlem world is in the building, baby. Yeah. He definitely represented, man. It's our first artist out there from Harlem. You know he came through, did his thing. You already know, Ace. You got something for this? Uh. Whoa. We got to sign them off with this one, man. Uh. Yeah, I said. Kev Cash, I'm that nigga really stunt. You a lame nigga, who that nigga really from? I'm a soul god, all my cars is really popping. Everyone, some, all my niggas really coming. With that hot one. If you see us, when you see us, don't stop run. If you from Harlem, me rockin', better cop one. Uh, oh, mm. I've got something to tell you. Yeah, you ready for this one? Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Listen to Interloop Radio, yakpinup.com, yeah, yeah, all of Let the beat drop. Uh, I said, let the beat drop. Yeah. Let me hold on to it. I said. Took it to the head, a lot of niggas couldn't make it once they touched on the islands. A lot of niggas have to fake it, it's a test for the real. A lot of niggas got to shake it, better memorize your pain. A lot of niggas got to take it, I remember I was starving. Hungry as hell, everybody wishing bad, they all be hoping I fail. Everybody think it's sweet, till they up in the cell. Wishing they never did it, hoping niggas don't tell. But back to the subject, I'm a young one dollars. Not everybody get a pound, I just tell them I holler. Cause everybody got a mask, I can tell you it's fake. What you know about patience, they always told me to wait, so I waited. Waited until my time, couple niggas made it home, a couple niggas doing nine, a couple niggas on the couch, couple niggas on the grind, couple bitches showing love, just went until I get signed to you, duh. I won't even fuck with them, cause if they ain't doing shit, they want you to stay stuck with them. I gotta keep it moving, I'm ahead of these cats. Good head on my shoulders, real dude speaking facts. I came up from the block, came up straight off the ass. A lot of niggas was telling I wasn't fucking with that. Where everyone spread a rumor, you know they love politics, and where every nigga get fly. Just to impress these bitches, where every bitch does respect. Just to impress these niggas, where all these niggas start talking. Just to get out a little quicker, now they talking and shit. But when I'm hated, just whisper. Pretty bitches on my body, now they hoping I kiss her, but that's a no no. That's a no to below. I I don't want no relations, I can't get too comfortable Can't yeah. wait to cop me a range, can't wait to cop me a rope There's some cars I don't pull, but y'all can still get exposed These niggas die, they're just dying to live I'm popping bottles and popping tags while I pop me a bitch I might be shopping for hours, I might just buy me a fit I might just go home front and go, I mean, uh-huh What? <laughs> 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 yeah, drop, drop, drop like three, four bombs on that one, DJ Ball uh, you know what I mean? I yes, sir. <laughs> yeah, Yo, hold on. I want Listen, to, man. I want to want one more track. I want to want that that Harlem track. The, um, the Jim Jones shit. The, the West Coast beat. Oh, we fly. No, not that nah, one. Not that joint. I know what you're talking about. Um, the Easy Beat. Yeah, the Easy Beat. The one Jim Jones did. What game? Um, Certified Gangsters. Certified Gangsters. Yeah, I want to want that. I want to want that. Whoa. And we signed it over that. We want you on one more track, bro. I mean, he killed that yeah, one. Yeah, he killed even yeah, that. He, he definitely went in. He dug deep for that one. Got a flow for every standing. You got something for this? Capo, Capo came off on this. It's something right that you do it too. Okay. This Compton slash Harlem right here. Yeah. So I'll just Compton though. <laughs> I said, since a nigga came up, nigga got his weight up. Since I got my money up, niggas got the hate up. Since a nigga show these now, all them niggas hate us. We don't want that boiling now, so he with a tape up. Fresh me, Jody, why you think she wanna date us? Every time it go down, police wanna state us. Never used to listen, so I had to put the beast up. Little more respect, little less makeup. Back the whole product, smoke a little shaker. Sleeping on the boy, man, I told these niggas wake up. Didn't 
to the real cause I'm tired of the fakeness Move real militant cause I always say less Too sky high, I don't think I wanna land Get rich, no jail, yeah that was the plan Got so many enemies, I keep it in my hand Can't trust no one, not even your own man yeah. Stay to myself, man, I keep my own distance Lesson for the streets, always move with persistence Take still pain cause happy these niggas snitching If he wasn't dead, now you get the witness huh? Yeah now they get to witness. <laughs> Y'all already know what it is. This is In the Loop Radio, man. Him said the Harlem, man. You already know. I'm impressed. Me too, sir. This brother came and did his thing. I mean, like. I'm young impressed. boy doing his thing. Yeah, young boy. You know, like, there be a lot of cats where, you know, you hear their music, where did they rap and how. But you know they they trying to keep what's going on with the you know the whole the whole Fetty exactly. lifestyle all that stuff. But then when they actually come in the studio and torch it, exactly. like I'm gonna keep it at hundred with you, bro. I won't expect this from you. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like I know you can do the <laughs> rhyme and everything, but, it's all, but I was not expecting this. Like he got some real bars. Yes, sir. <laughs> he got some real bars, man. Yes, sir. I'm impressed, sleeping man. Sleeping on me, he's sleeping on me. That's the Harlem way, man. Word. Yo, let the people know how can they find you, man. You know what I mean? Give them that, all the handles, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, uh, YouTube, Instagram, SoundCloud. Kev Finesse, underscore, underscore, two, underscore. SoundCloud is Kev Cash. YouTube, Kev Cash, S with a dollar sign. That's what it is. All right, you got to be on YouTube. DJ Var. I mean, videos on YouTube. Video on YouTube, just put Kev Cash with a S dollar sign. Right. You're going to see all of them, Jones. Okay. And right, you're going to come soon. That's what's up, yo. Definitely, man. Thanks for coming on the show. It was a pleasure, man. We, we've been trying to get more. You reached out to me about a month and a half ago. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, yo, bro, what up? Like, all right, son, give me some time, man. We gonna make a pop. Thought you was fine. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? You DM me on the regular, like, yo, son, what up? I said, my nigga, I got you, man. We gonna make it happen. You came and did your thing. Mm -hmm. You know? Definitely a friend to the show. Kev Cash, man, Harlem World. Y'all know what it is. In the Loop Radio, yakradio.com. Tune in every Sunday, 7 to 10. You know, shout out to the lovely Erica Orson who came through earlier. Shout out to Young Fashion who debuted her new track. You know, catch a case, catch that on sound on um, that pimp tonight. In the Loop Radio, man. Yeah, shit.